got to pick some snacks up. Then I can eat these before I go off. And see if I can video the uh, oh, market, Bolton market. I tripped over the curb then. That's fine. <laughs> Right, so uh, that little journey to the market didn't work out right. Uh, they'll not let you video. Uh, they'll not let you video in the market unless you get permission off the town hall. So I have spoke to them, and they've said they will inquire. They will try and get me permission for and send me an email. Uh, so it's looking like Bolton Market's going to be <laughs> a no-no. For, uh, for a week or so so we'll have to try that one on another one so I will have to <laughs> uh, visit another market and see what I can do but I'd rather get permission because then I can video whatever I want then within reason uh, because like I say in this country we're a bit particular about videoing markets so yeah but this area here uh, it's, it's quite, what's it with? Uh, filming recently, I'm sure they've just been doing a series around this area. Uh, in this particular building. Uh, I forgot what it's called. Um, but I think it was on Netflix. So the series, I think, is on Netflix in this. This is the actual area where they did uh, one of the episodes. So all I can do is film a bit of Bolton for you. So that's what we'll do. I'll, I'll film the town centre. Let you see some of the town centre. Uh, and that's all I can do. I apologise for not doing the market. <laughs> so we're having a town centre video this time. And then I will continue with the markets after this one, I suppose. Uh, which just shows that you can get problems. Look at that waterfall. Lighting's a bit dark at the net, but uh, it's because it's it was sunny earlier on. I don't know whether it was sunny in Bolton earlier on, but it was sunny where I came from before. Oh, 20 flowers. This is Bolton Town Hall. It's a pretty big building. In a minute I'll stand back so you can uh, you can actually see it a bit better. There is a waterfall on both sides. But it's quite a big building. Uh, <coughs> we'll go over to this other side, there's a monument over here so we'll have a look at this monument. I think it's the First World War monument. Uh, yep. There we go. Looks like I timed it just right with the bells there. Well, now you can see the building. We turn round. And I'll show you the full view. Looks very similar to the White House to me. <laughs> but yeah, it's half past four p.m. Obviously, it'd be dark. Oh no, it wouldn't. It would actually be daylight now in this country. 
at 4.30 a.m. Oh, it's 4.30 p.m. That's an absolutely brilliant shot. That's Bolton Town Hall. Uh, in a minute, I'll take you down towards uh, the indoor precinct, if I can, before it closes. And we'll have a walk down there. Uh, I'll go around that side, that way back afterwards, and show you the uh, place where they did the filming. Uh, as far as I know. I'll try and keep the view straight if I can, but I am walking, with, I, I'm not using a stick, so it, it will bounce about a bit. I'll try and keep it as steady as I can. Well, a lot, of, a lot of the stores are closed at the minute because uh, it's getting closed in time. There's an actual steam engine inside this building coming up. I'll show you that when I get there. Uh, show you the steam engine inside this building. Uh, it's behind glass. There we go. I'll actually scroll down it a bit and then you can always pause it and reread it. As you can see, it's a uh, pretty big steam engine. <laughs> so that's it. <coughs> right, carry on. Cafe Nero, uh, one of my favourite Italian coffee shops. Uh, definitely one of the best. McDonald's across the road. Subway. You got Subway as well. We're in the corner. Quite, quite a lot of uh, lot of stores, but like I say, it is getting towards closing time, so there's not as many here. I think if I came here about two hours ago, I think it would have been absolutely packed. Uh, up there you got the Pound Bakery. We have one of them in Lee. <laughs> Always a favourite, Pound Bakery. You don't have to spend more than a pound. Although these days, even the pound stores are not pound stores anymore. I know I used to be the manager of one. But uh, this is the indoor marketplace at Bolton. Now, I might have the same problem here as well, but we're going to go and try, I think. I just have to have a look at the signpost outside. See what the signpost says. Uh... If the time post says no video in or no cameras, then I'll, I'll just won't be able to do it. Simple as. I don't think you can. I don't know. 
but I'll find out. I'll see if I can or not, but I'll... Nope, can't. <laughs> I didn't think you could. Can't do no video and no I'll record it inside, which is really disappointing. I mean, how, how do they expect people to want to come to some places if they won't even allow you to show what the place is like? I mean, it's called advertising. Uh, we'll have a walk up the main street. It's called advertising, isn't it? You know what I mean? You don't advertise, you don't get as simple as. Uh, this actually looks quite good. Cursed pasties. I've never, never, I'm thinking, I'm seriously thinking of getting a pasty now. I don't know. Yeah, I've just, I, I, I'm videoing, I'm YouTubing, but I've just spotted the sign saying Bolton's favourite pasta. Yeah. Thank you, Doc. I'm wondering whether, have you got any? Yeah. Yes, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking of getting one, but see if it becomes one of Lee's finest pasta. Uh -huh. Because I'm not a Wigginer, I'm a writer. And we have loads of pastas, but they call us lobby gobblers. We don't eat that much lobby, we eat pastas. Right. You don't mind, I've got this running at minute recording. Yeah, I'll cut it out if you have to. Right, brilliant. Brilliant. And you better come back. I will come back. I have to, my YouTubers are going to have a go at me, but don't. I, I've actually turned up in Bolton, right? Yeah. Because I'm going all over the northwest to different market towns. Oh, nice, yeah. And I'm even going down to uh, Fleetwood. But I've just been to. Open market, we can't film there, even though I've not spotted a sign. But security said I can't film. We used to be on that. So I've literally, yeah, yeah, listen, guys, look, there it is. Freshly baked. In fact, is it hot? It is hot. <laughs> right, uh, oh, yeah, there's not just markets in Bolton, there's pasta shops as well. <laughs> uh, Shop. Yeah, best, best pasta, pasta shop. shop. Yeah, yeah, I'll show. I'll put the sign out there in a minute yeah. when I go outside. Uh, you know. Anyway, thank you. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Oh, I've got a pay for this. Are you sure? Right, brilliant. See, there you go. Everybody, everybody will be coming down now. <laughs> right, thank you, thank you, <laughs> thank you. Yeah, there you go. See, you guys, look, cars, cars, pastas. So, if you ever come in Bolton and then come down to cars and get a, a pasta, absolutely brilliant. And they got freebie, so that's not bad. That, that, that is really good. Yes, I like that. Very good. I've got people shouting hello now. <laughs> I cannot believe I got a free pasta. Wow. Right, I got to uh, try this pasta when I get back. See what I mean? Uh, that is really good. I, I, I'm well chuffed about that now. Well chuffed. I've put this in my pocket. Try not to squash it, uh, and then I'll show you the pasta in a bit. There we go. Got it in my pocket now. It's there, warm in there. There's Greg's. Now I've got a free pasta, Greg's.
<laughs> and McDee's. I got a free pasta, McDee's. Now, I wonder if I went in Cafe Nero to give me a free coffee. <laughs> Somehow I don't think so. But it was worth a try. I cannot believe that I actually did that. I honestly can't. Fred Dibner. I actually met him years ago. He used to have a steam traction engine. Uh, and I've met this person. In fact, when I was little, he came and he, he, he exploded uh, an old chimney stack. Because uh, he was a steeplejack, he used to climb chimneys and, and like, knock them down. Just using fire alone, you just knock them down. So, uh, yeah, I've met that person. That's another claim to fame. <laughs> oh, ignore me, I'm waffling on now. Right, so we're going to walk back up this way, doing this quick tour of Bolton Town Centre. It is a lot bigger than this, I've just not got time to go everywhere. Because uh, time's getting a bit on an F drive home yet, so, and the weather's looking a bit. Yes, weather's looking a lot. Uh, a lot of doors are shut at the minute because it's uh, so we'll go back round this way and walk round here because this is was a film location. I don't know whether it was a film or a series on Netflix, but this is it. So some people may recognise this from there. You've got the Albert Hall on the left inside the building. Uh, and we'll go around. It's very similar. It's similar looking to uh, Paris, Venice. So you can get places like that in this country, but this is really nice. You can hear the bells. I think it's going to chime in a minute with the time. No? So it must be quarter to. No, half past. Is it? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> quarter to, probably. But yeah, this this building and area was definitely in a series or film recently, recently made. Uh, it goes up to the museum. It goes up to the museum. Still the cobblestones, still use the cobblestones on the, on the road. They're coming up to Bolt Museum on the right. But I have no idea. I have no idea what they're doing with the construction. Not a clue. There's Bolton Town all there. This side, the entrance. Uh, I've been to a couple of weddings there. You can, you can wave. <laughs> YouTube. On Mulder's channel. Yeah, see, uh, definitely, and this is Bolt Museum, so. which is, yeah, that's the back end, 
of the tone off. Uh, it's 10 to so it was quarter to when it was tuned. And this is Octagon, Octagon Theatre. Uh, well, yeah, so that's, yeah, that's what it was called. Uh, I'll rewind on this afterwards and find out what they actually said. <laughs> but they didn't want me to film one because it's, uh, some don't, so. And that's the Octagon Theatre there. Quite a lot of famous people played, done plays there at Octagon Theatre. Um, I think we're going to be heading back. I think we'll head down this direction. I came that way before, so we'll head this way. Uh, there used to be a pound store there. I remember there being a pound store there because I used to be the manager of pound store and I came up here to help them help them build inside it uh, so that's not lasted at all but yeah that used to be an old uh, pound store I definitely remember it I remember coming and fitting it out quite a few years ago It's just 44 minutes. We've got 44 minutes left on my parking, so I've just got time for to go down this other end. So I'll head down this other end and then back up again to the car. Well, I've got the 40 minutes left on the car park. And we'll see what's down here. Well, like I said, I picked the wrong time. Wrong day, probably. Probably Tuesday, Saturday. I'll probably come up Saturday and then I'll probably regret it, but <laughs> but I probably will. Uh, yeah, I see some people don't mind being on video, some don't like being on video. It all depends, really, but and plus they don't know who you are, they don't know which channel you are, you see. So that's why I always tell them which channel I am, so they can check it out and look if they want to look. And uh, make it a lot easier. Business school. I'm presuming that's some kind of college or school. <laughs> Never heard of it. But there is some stores down here, so I can have a look down here at the stores. But I think most of them are closed. Most of the takeaways that's open. Well, that's the square, shopping square, Bolton Town Centre. Uh, and then we've got the Bolton bus station, interchange. I'll show you that why I'm here. They just recently changed over, like leader, they changed over to B transport. So you see a big picture of a, a yellow B. Black and yellow. Over the front entrance. Uh, and then you've got the business school. It's quite a lot of... Uh, buildings around but a lot of them are closed and the closed mainly closed because of the time it's round about the time that everybody starts going home and things like that uh, but I don't know when they changed to uh, B transport not sure but I think it was recent yeah but I'm not going to go inside and, and film because they don't like filming inside but yeah this is it B transport yeah so uh, I was I was talking to the 
Well, I was trying to ask about the B Company and uh, when it started here in Bolton. But, uh, and there's a buzz here, so, see? It's a B network. There's another one. Which we have in Lino as well. Because uh, the sea probably taking over quite a lot. But I just want to show you this. I don't even know why that's there. I think it's just monumental wise for the bridge. I think it just makes it look different. <laughs> so I'll just show you that. I don't think it's actually holding it up. I don't know what it does, to be honest. Uh, but I think I'll walk this way and we'll walk all the way around. Because I've been through the town centre now, so I may as well walk all the way around and show you. Uh, but I think it's just, I think it's monumental. I don't think it actually holds the bridge up. <laughs> I don't think the bridge is big enough for that, to be honest. But unless it's because a lot of weight goes over with the buzzes, because the buzz goes over every second by the looks of it. But yeah, uh, so that's it. Don't know what it's for. Not quite sure what it does, but the pigeons like it. I can see the pigeons like it. <laughs> There's a church over there. I don't know what that church is. Uh, in fact, we'll have a walk over to that church. I'll see if I can find out what it is. We can't, we can't look at the church and then not find out what name it is. I think the railway station's over here as well, because that connects with the bus station, see? Because of the tram. Because I'm not sure, but I think a tram actually goes from here to Manchester. Uh, but I can't confirm that at the minute. But I think there's a possibility that the tram goes from here to Manchester or something like that. Or at least the train does. So I think this is the railway station that I'm coming up to, which is connected, as you can see, to the bus station. Which is a good idea. Saves you walking all the way around, I suppose. No idea. But I'm presuming that walkway goes straight from the station to station. There's no shortage of clocks. Let me zoom in. You see two clocks there. One of them's not got anything on the face. And then if I pan round again, you see Morrison's. You see the other clock in the centre there that we saw before. So it's quite a lot of clocks. They're definitely uh, well looked up on time here. I can hear a, I can hear a, yeah, there's a train. So the train just gone past the bus station. If I zoom out again, then it might go a bit dark. Right? I don't know. It does look a bit dark. Oh, plenty of taxis, no shot of taxi. <laughs> Talk so. Yeah, so I'm presuming that walkway goes to uh, the bus station, as far as I know. And I think it's Bolton, Bolton Railway Station. Yeah. Yep, Bolton Railway Station. You can see straight down there, look. It's pretty big, it's a lot bigger than it used to be. I remember this when it was a dead tiny station. Uh, so we're going to try and find out what this church is. If I don't get myself run down by a bike. Yeah, cycle lanes. It looks like it's Trinity Church. We've got little Diddy traffic lights, look at these. Cool. I've not seen these before. That's for the bikes. Even the bikes have got traffic lights of their own. That's cool. I've definitely not seen that one before. Right. I don't know how much power's left on this, but 
I've definitely not seen the traffic lights for the bikes before. That's really cool. I'm crossing. I just... I just, I just, I want to, I want to know, can you hear me? Yeah. I want to know if any of your bags go through on that little red line. Oh yeah, that's it. I Do they that. actually get full? Because <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> from that. Unbelievable. I've never seen them before. Yeah. I'm, I'm from Lee, but I've not seen them anywhere else. Right. <laughs> Have you any idea, oh, is it called Trinity? Church? Say again. Trinity Church. I think so, yeah. I'm only guessing that because of I that think saying. So, yeah. uh, I don't know, to be honest with you, but yeah, I think right. so. I'm just videoing Bolton for YouTube. So. Oh, there we go. Nice. Yeah. And they've actually got a clock on this side, but it doesn't work. It's a pity. It's a pity because the grass is well kept. <laughs> Yeah, the grass is well kept. But that month. Uh, so, yeah. As you can see, it's definitely uh, closed. It's a derelict church. The clocks are non existent. Uh, it's called Trinity Church, Bolton. That's a shame. It's so nice, unless they're doing it up, because it looks so nice outside, and the grass is well tended. So maybe they're doing it up, I don't know. And then you've got Sainsbury's over there in the distance, and another clock. <laughs> no shortage of clocks, what time is it? Oh my god, these are impossible to walk on. I don't think you're meant to be walking on them. I don't want to get knocked down now. Plenty of traffic. I mean, I could have gone down the bottom end uh, and had a look down there, but I'll show you that on a different day, I think. More than likely. Just wait to get across here. No shortage of traffic. This past is uh, keeping me warm. <laughs> here we go. We can get across one part anywhere. Aha. Well, there's another bee bus. And a blue one. Same company, different colour. Didn't know we had blue bees though in this country, but it's looking like we have now. We're going. So I've just got to walk straight up this road. Another look at the church there. How cool is that? Maybe that's another playlist I should put. There's, there's quite a few playlists I could put actually. Uh, castles, churches. You lay off, let me know, drop a comment. Put it in the comments. Uh, suggest some other playlists. Uh, castles is a good idea. It means a lot of travelling. But then again, we are at the beginning of summer, so maybe I might be able to do one this summer. Uh, and what was the other I said? Churches. Yeah, and there's plenty of churches around. You don't have to travel very far for churches, but I'm sure it will spread out further and further. But I think that could be a good playlist as well. 
uh, wander around a few uh, out, outside of a few churches, maybe get inside, you know, views on some of them, depending with permission. So, yeah, I think we'll try that. Why not? Uh, churches and castles. <laughs> There's loads of crazy lists you could do, really, like bus stations, railway stations, but I'm, I'm sure other people have probably done that. But it doesn't matter. YouTube is YouTube, and every bit helps. So the more YouTubers, the better. That's all I can say. Uh, if it weren't for YouTubers, half the places we wouldn't even know in this, this country. So I would. Yeah. Uh, Wix. Wix. Building supplies. They do a lot of uh, supplies for councils. Uh, but we, it looks like we're going to, oh, we can get across. Makes a change. But we're not far off the car park now. So. And then that will be the end of the video. But there is there is still some more places in Bolton. Uh, it's, it's, I, I've only shown you a quarter of Bolton Town Centre. It's four times the size of what I showed you. So, uh, yeah, maybe another video. Uh, and I can show you the uh, other ends of Bolton in a few different directions. Maybe we should be pressing button, what do you think? It worked. <laughs> yeah. That's the direction I came in. That's the direction I'll be going out in a minute. Unless I decide to take the uh, scenic route and you might be able to see some of the places. Uh, the car park I, I actually parked in, by the way, it's called Black Horse Street Car Park. There it is. Black Horse Street. And the car park company, the car park company, <laughs> I shall remind in a minute. Uh, because it's an online company, so you don't have to pay. You, have, like, you pay up front. And then it tells you a minute how long you've got left on your phone, so you can always keep an eye out how long you've got left. Speaking of which, I'm going to check now. I can see my car there. I've got 40, uh, 25 minutes. Let me just show you. NCP car parks, I think it is. There it is. I'll show you on my, foot, on my app. Can you see it? 25 minutes. And you just pick the street that you want to park in. Oh, I put my hand, I'm sorry, I put my finger over the top of the thing. But that's it, 25 minutes left. So, here's my vehicle. It's a bit dirty at the minute. Uh, but you just, I'll show you my aliens on the side. There it is. That belongs to Moldus Channel. Uh, and that's it, that's, I just have to get us in now, as soon as I find my keys, got them. i will pocket the police car down there, I think he's probably looking at me thinking is he pinching that car, <laughs> but he's not. There we go, we're back, right, I shall end the video, and I'll, I'll probably, no I won't, I'll probably take a journey through town centre with car at the minute. See you in a minute. So, here's the three passes I got. Uh, it's a bit blurred, the camera. I think I must have touched the lens. Hang on a minute. Yeah, there we go. Freshly baked, in store, cars, passes. 
Uh, let's just get it out the packet. If I can. Oh, there's a piece of it there. There's the pasta. Potato. And bits of beef in there. I know the taste. Let's see what it tastes like. Mm. <laughs> yeah. That is actually quite good. Good firm texture. It isn't a flaky pasta. It's uh what do they call it? What do they call it? Uh Plain. It's plain pastry, so it's just flat pastry. But it's really, I think it's a bit buttery. But yeah, whoa. That is really good. So, <clears throat> I would definitely recommend 100%. Cars, C A R R S, Cars Bakery in Bolton. Go and check it out because the pastas are really good. I'm not saying you get a free pasta, but if you mention Mulder's channel when you go in, you never know. <laughs> because, yeah. I'll tell you now, visiting Bolton, get a car's pasta. Wow. We're going to eat your heart out. <laughs> there is some good Wigan pastas, but yeah, this is definitely different. I like this. Yeah, I can eat these. They're not too salty or... The mix is just right. And the pastry, it isn't hard. It's it like melts in your mouth, it is really good. Good and that pasta is still hot. I've had that <laughs> well it, it, it's it's between very warm and hot. Just right for eating. Uh sometimes you let them cool down, they taste a lot better than trying to eat them red hot. But yeah, that is really good. Oh, so yeah, Cars Pastis, Cars Bakery. In, uh, I don't know the name of the street, but I think if you put it in uh, Google, you'll probably find it. So yeah, check that out. We'll be driving to each town centre in a few minutes. Alright, so there we go. Heading back. Don't know which way we're going to go through here, so I think we're going to go left. And we'll head that direction eventually. See where this takes us. I don't know whether we can turn this direction or not, but we will. Here we go. See if I can get a quick run round bolt on itself. Uh, but it doesn't look like I'm going to get very far. Could get stuck down a one-way street. Well, the road across the road, I don't know whether you can see the signpost. Uh, I can quickly zoom in. 
and it says A666, and that is no lie. That leads up, the A676 leads up to the A666, which goes past the Witch's Country in Pendle Hill. A666. So it does exist. So there you go. So we're on the A676 now. And this road continues all the way up to the A666. So I'm going to go straight through. And uh, <coughs> it's not very far away from Winter Hill, actually, Bolton. It's kind of in the dip after Winter Hill. So you can see Bolton from Winter Hill. And things like that. I think we're going left here because we're going to go out a different direction. So we're going left. Uh, I think this goes quite, poss quite, quite possibly past the hospital. And I'm not 100% certain. So we'll have a ride down this way. Head back and see how far it goes. There's a park. I don't know what the park's called. I couldn't tell you that. I would have to look on Google. I can't see a side post. I think it's just an open playing field, to be honest. I don't think it's a park as such. Maybe it was years ago. But it isn't now. Can't see the sign for it. This is, we're turning into Murr Street. I only know that because I got the sat nav running. <laughs> I'm cheating a bit though. So we're going to turn right into Murr Street. M A Y O R. There we go. Getting a bit of noise off the CB radio there. Bit of skip noise. Now we're going uphill. Uh, that looks a nice park actually. It's bigger than I thought. I don't know what park it is. I still can't see this. Queen's Park. Queen's Park Bolton. There you go. So now we know the sign, we know the uh, name, that was Queen's Park. <coughs> I never thought, I should have just looked on the sat nav, it would tell me on the sat nav. <laughs> it's handy to have your sat nav running when, I mean I know my way around but When you're running in places like this and there's parks and things like that, you don't know what they're called. That looks like a big stately home though, I don't know what that is. Uh, that's not showing up on my sat now. <laughs> Just as I said it, it's a private house, it's called East Lodge. Wow, that is a big, big driveway they had there. Looked like a roadway. But I don't know whether you can tell on the camera, but this is uphill. Pretty steep hill, actually. There's a signpost coming up. Somebody's got faulty brake lights so. there.
traffic, 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 traffic. I'll pause it till we get moving again. Now we're on the move, eventually, I think. The lights have changed, just nobody's moving. Wow, that took a while. The signpost says Orich left, Preston left, Bolton right. So we're going left. No, we're not. We're going right, actually, because I wanted to show you the other side of Bolton, didn't I? So, <clears throat> we are now heading back down to Bolton again from a different direction. And hopefully, show you a little bit more. I think this is a pop show. There's the, uh, I think that's a, a school or a college on the right. Bolton, Bolton College, actually, I think. Oh, Bolton School. So it must be Bolton High School. That's pretty big. It's a nice building. Lots of little windows. Wow. In fact, I re I'm sure I remember years ago when I first left school and I was going on a window cleaning job because I did do a window cleaning job and I fell 48 feet. That ended that career. But I remember doing up here, and I remember mentioning that school and saying, we've got contract on that school, so who fancies doing it? And when I looked at all the little tiny windows, I went, no way. <laughs> it would take you a day just to do one, one side. <laughs> yeah, so I don't know how much... Uh, Power I've got left on my phone because I've been filming for quite a while now. I think uh, this video is a bit longer than I expected it to be, but that's because I couldn't just do the market. Uh, hopefully, we'll get permission for do the market. But in the meantime, there's probably some other markets that I could probably uh, go to in the next few days or during this next week. So we will visit another market. I promise. It may turn out to be Bury Market because it's in the similar area. It, you just follow up. You just follow this road to to Bury. And then, of course, we've got Charlie Market. So we will be going to see some more markets. But I'm just sorry I couldn't uh, film it. So. Now we're heading back down to the town centre. It's definitely downhill, as you can see. Pretty steep as well. I'm in third gear at the minute. I'm going to fourth now, it's levelling up a bit. <coughs> Shut the corner here. Oh! To work out where I'm going here. I'm not sure. It's very easy to get lost. Well, I think I'm turning right. As far as I know. As far as I know, I'm turning right. When he gets going round, that is. Eventually. Uh, I think maybe I should have gone straight across because I'm taking you back in the same place. <laughs> So anyway, I think uh, I think I may end up at, uh, ending the video here. I'll go straight on that way. Uh, wait till we get out of the town centre, and then I'll uh, 
think about what I'm doing. This is the back end of the market, by the way, where we are now here on the left, where the railings are. Uh, <clears throat> I can't believe I couldn't film it. I should have just, I should have just videoed it, but then it wouldn't feel right. So. Wigan and Lee said down the signpost and then where you saw it, that's the direction we're headed. <coughs> There's a lot of new buildings here in uh, Bolton. I don't remember this one being here on the right. This building on the left is centre for film effects. You must do special effects there. Uh, and then we got the University of Bolton in front, <coughs> part of it. Motor Vehicle Employer Academy. Must be all colleges round there. Acad academies and colleges and things like that. I was going to go left, but apparently it said you can't go left. But you can. <laughs> I was going to go left. So I'll turn down another road in a minute. If I can. We'll do a quick U-turn here. There we go. And we'll just turn round here. Head back up. Do a reverse, a quick reverse here. Hopefully. Yeah, there we go. And we'll head back down this way and turn right. As soon as I go out. Try and get to that centre lane if I can. As soon as the traffic lights me. Come on. And away we go. But there was no, there was no left turn error when I was coming that way, so nothing indicated that you could go left. Well, you can, because I'm about to turn right. You can see a better view. It is University of Bolton, actually. That there, that new building that you can see on the left. Can't quite see the signpost on the camera, but it is University of Bolton. I think all this area here is University of Bolton. Uh, 
I think they need a bit of weed killing there on the right. I'll come and stream that for them if they pay me. I wonder. Now we've got a right turn here now. Away from the town centre. The town centre's to the left. We're going right. Automatic tuition. It's somebody in an automatic car. I know a few people what would probably prefer that, but I prefer manual. There we go. Keeps your brain more active driving a manual car. That's the way I see it. I couldn't just sit here just pressing pedals. Uh, rather be changing gears and things good for the brain I'm going to have to close the window up a little bit it's getting a little bit on the cooler side and drafty side we, we are now heading up the road that I came in on And uh, once I get out of Bolton, gets a bit easier. The traffic's always bad here. There's a mosque on the right hand side. I don't know the name of the mosque. <coughs> it looks like it's a Turkish mosque. Going up a symbol on top. I don't know anything about mosques. But I don't see no name on it because this is not the front.